and all of the beautiful women I encountered throughout those years. And I thought about an oyster. And if you know anything about an oyster and how a pearl is formed, I started thinking about the oyster being incarceration. Sand gets trapped. Just one grain of sand gets trapped on the inside of an oyster. And it's an aggravation. And the oyster begins to try to get rid of it, but it can't. And it continues, that little grain of sand aggravates it for years. And while it's aggravating it for years, that grain of sand is turning into a pearl. And I think about the incarcerated women, how we were just grains of sand, right? right. Yeah. Nothing too important to anybody, not even to ourselves at times. But when we were on the inside, we aggravated the system, we aggravated ourselves, we learned things about ourselves, we became strong individuals, powerful sisters, knowledgeable, and we grew in love for each other and for ourselves. Just like that pearl on the inside, that was us. And so many of us now are just like these pearls. One of the hardest, most sought after gems or pearls in the world. It's a precious, precious pearl. And that's what so many of us have become. Just like the pearls. And that's what we are now. We're sought after by so many. I know so many of you in here are, are working endlessly on criminal justice reform throughout this country. And you have the opportunity to go in front of many, many powerful people when once all you were was a grain of sand. Whoa. Yeah. Yeah.